Hello friends, this is Rupesh and I'm watching CPP Nerds video series on C++ STL algorithm series and this video is about is sorted until and this video is not that complex video but I have to give these videos because I am creating a full series on algorithm available in STL in C++ and it is always good if you know what is already available in C++ algorithm so then you don't have to write your own stuff. So as the name says, is sorted until finds how many elements are actually sorted in given range. Meaning from first to last, whatever the range you are giving, including first, excluding last, how many numbers are sorted from first. So it's like you apply like is sorted until and you give the range here I'm giving from beginning to end, meaning I'm giving a full vector here. You can give any range and by default it is increasing order sorting i mean ascending order sorting and it returns the traitor like till what it was able to find the numbers are in sorted order and then i'm taking the difference and i will just print it so wait a minute i'll just simply execute this and we'll understand this whole thing a little better so let's compile this and execute this see it is saying that only first number is the one which is sorted because we are taking the diff or the distance so this is sorted return the pointer which is pointing at 3. So the difference from 0 to 3 is 1. So that's why it is saying 1 here. Okay. We can see that. Because it is not in sorted order from here afterwards. Because we are looking for the ascending order. So 3 is less than 4 then only one number is sorted. So this is how it means. So if you want a descending order sort let's do that. So it will be 3 then. Let's simply compile and execute this. Yeah, see it is 3 now. So it means 4, 3, 2. These three numbers are in sorted order but in descending order. If I will make this 6 as 1 and save it and compile it, this time it will get 4. Yeah, see. Because we are looking for the descending one. And we are saying that from beginning to end, search from beginning and go till the end but we can give any place so let's give from beginning plus one meaning we will start from three now so three to one we will get again three let's compile this and execute this uh oh this is a little weird i don't know what it is oh just oh my goodness if i am giving this range then obviously i will be taking this also right then wait a minute i will compile this and see now it is three yeah sure <laughs> so i was making this range plus one but i just forgot to change this one so obviously if you're saying that my range is from this to this then you have to take the distance also from here to here okay so this video is not so complex but you know that okay there is something like this available in algorithms in stl so thanks for watching and maybe next video is not on uh, STL algorithm. Next video I will give AVL3 which is balanced binary search tree and there I'll explain how to construct from the beginning and if it is not balanced then how to automatically balance it because balancing is really very important topic and it is very easy. So till then bye bye take care.